Welcome to Spokane, Washington. This is American Dream TV, and I'm your host, Steve Silbar. Today, I want to take you to the North Monroe District. This is one of the revitalized areas of town. This area is full of trendy shops and restaurants, brew pubs, a great tattoo parlor, and the region's best appliance store and showroom. But every great neighborhood also has a great coffee house. I'm gonna take you to Ladder Coffee, one of the area's best. Come along, let's take a look. So today we're here with the owner of Ladder Coffee. This is Aaron Rifkin. Aaron. Great to see you. Yeah, great to be here. Thanks for being here. So tell us a little bit. I mean, I know the backstory on you guys that you start on your porch. Yeah. On weekends, you serve coffee to 100 people. Kind of explain how that process <laughs> grew to this. Yeah. So, you know, we had a dream to open up a coffee company here in Spokane. And so we just had friends that were gathering on Saturday mornings on our front porch. Uh, about 15 of us showed up every Saturday, had some yard games. And then all of a sudden, uh, we were able to have, you know, 50 people come and then 75. And then it's been really fun to go, to go from that to here we are today. Excellent. Yeah. So where, where do you source your coffees from? Yeah, so all over the world. So we roast coffees all the way from Guatemala to Ethiopia to Kenya, um, really just trying to figure out where can we find the best uh, graded coffees so that way our customers can drink those coffees. Excellent. Now in 2018, you guys won an amazing award. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, so in 2018, we uh, were able to take second place in World's Best New Cafe uh, with Sprudge. And so it's a pretty well-known online uh, resource that goes around and tries to find the best coffee uh, in the world. And so we took second place on that here in uh, Spokane. That's excellent. So yeah. not just Spokane, not just Washington, not the US, but the world. But the world. Yeah, we That's were up incredible. against people with like, from like Japan, Australia, um, I mean, literally from all over the world. It was unreal. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. So Eric, can you tell us about the roasting process? Yeah, so uh, here we have our Dietrich IR-5. This, uh, this machine was actually built in Sandpoint, Idaho, uh, which is actually in our backyard, only about an hour, hour and a half away. Uh, and so what we do is we take the coffee green, we get it from the, from you know, obviously from the farm, it goes inside of this hopper here, it gets inside of this drum, and it spins kind of like a, uh, like a dryer. There's like these little arms that kind of toss the coffee. And so it uh, heats it up and then uh, roasts it and then falls out and that's what we have here is the uh, roasted coffee. So this is our production room where we uh, produce all of our coffees. Uh, it is the place where all the magic happens. Dave is actually our head roaster. Uh, I'm typically back here helping bag and load up all the coffees that get to you guys at, you know, for subscriptions, our wholesale partners. We have wholesale partners all across the United States. One of our largest wholesale accounts um, is over in uh, Evans, Georgia. Um, so we have coffee being shipped out of this tiny little room, uh, hundreds and hundreds of pounds every week going out. And so this is a really fun room, kind of like the Willy Wonka room. So yeah, so the goal for us is to help transition, you know, your typical coffee drinker from, you know, Maxwell House or Folgers into these really bright, really fun coffees. And so, you know, you drink our monophonic, which is right. our darkest roasted coffee. And the goal for that coffee is to help transition you into, um, you know, some of our lighter and brighter coffees. One of the cool things about Ladder is they have a subscription coffee service, which I'm a subscriber of. So Aaron, can you kind of explain how that all came about? Yeah, so back when COVID started, we realized that um, our cafes weren't getting any customers. So how did we get our coffee into homes? It was through subscriptions. And so we launched that back in 20, 20, where you know people from all over the US, most it started with local, but then it really graduated to people from all over the US now order our coffee. So if you are in California or you are in New York watching this, you can go online at laddercoffee.com, sign up for a subscription, and it will show up to your doorstep. Excellent. Thank you for joining us today on American Dream TV. I'm your host, Steve Silbar. Until next time, be good. If you can't be good, be great.